bottles of beer on the wall, hundreds of bottles of beer. Which one's the right one for me? Sometimes the answer's not that clear. My best bet's to begin by tuning on into French Hot Beer Reviews. Hey there on YouTube land. And welcome to French Hawes Bear Reviews. I am Scott. And I am Jeff. Mr. Freeze has got another can of beer. It's got 16 ounces, which is one pint. Two cups. You know. It's called Pseudo Sioux Pale Ale. From Iowa. The Cora Ira. Ira? Ira. Ira. <laughs> <laughs> Toppling Goliath Brewing Company. Yes. Yes. 6.8% alcohol, 45 IBUs, single hop, Citra. Pat Dowling with a donation. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, Patrick. Um, we have had Pompeii, which is their IPA, uh, recently distributed in Rhode Island. Uh, very, very good IPA. And, um, I've heard that this is a pretty highly rated beer. Is it? We're going to find know. out. We're going to find out um, after we rate it, of course, because we don't look up reviews before. We like to give our honest opinions, not swayed by any anything we read. So when we research these beers, we are staying away from review sites and trying to get just, uh, just the facts on this. Uh, the opinions will come later. Um, aroma is nice citrus head. and mango. Uh, it's bright with just enough bite. It's uh, they categorize this as a Midwest IPA. No, Midwest Pale Ale. Oh uh, yeah, I'm sorry, Midwest Pale Ale. Which I don't really know what that means. It's not from India. Yeah, just pale. So there's obviously a Tyrannosaurus Rex on the can. Yes. Which is a pretty cool can. And somehow they be became uh, involved with the Fields Museum in Chicago. And um, there was a T-Rex that was found in 1990 by someone uh, named Sue. It was dead. And this beer replaced a recipe that was... Uh, where, do you know where, we, where she found it? No. But the recipe was similar. Tsunami. It was a Tsunami Pale Ale. Yeah. And they, this was a new recipe. They wanted to kind of freshen it up. And... Uh, yeah, that's, that's what it. they got. Pseudo Sue was written on the fermenting tank, and it just became the Stuck. name. Yeah. And what's cooler than having a T Rex on your can? All right, smell this stuff. Nice, you're holding a nice head. What do the bubbles look like? Ah, uh, medium to uh, small. Medium to small, yeah. <laughs> the lacing like a mofo. Yeah, buddy. Chunky, chunky sea monkey. Oh action. gosh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sea monkeys galore. Bright white sea monkeys, mid-sized, probably two-week-old sea monkeys. Yep. Something like that. Not really jumpers, though. Oh, it smells delicious. It, does. it doesn't smell like a, a pale ale at all. You've got to drink it. <laughs> oh, man. It's just good. delicious. Wow. Very good. Yeah. Uh, hop aroma, hops up front, and mm -hmm. then just fruity, a citrus roller coaster. Like, boom. Mm -hmm. Like, I agree. There's nothing else. Oh, like awesome. Citrus just carries through. Wow, really good. Now I can see why this was mm -hmm. one of the top 100 beers currently. Currently. I do get the mango too. Wow, it's good. I'm telling you, 2018 is the year of the pale ale. Maybe you could be correct. I, I'm, I'm. They're just trying to tone it down a little bit. I, I think so. I mean, 6.8 percent. That's a that's an IPA. That, well, I mean, if you go by alcohol, yeah, it is. Maybe there's not enough. There isn't that bite of a IPA, mm -hmm. but it's pretty damn close. <sighs> So pretty dang close. It's very good. All right, uh, let's uh, put a number on it. Oh man, is it my turn? I'm probably at like a 
I got one. I got it. So go ahead. I'm locked in. 4-2. Four 4-2. Two. Four two. I'm a lot higher. 4-6. Wow. Six. Wow. Four 4-6. Six. I really, really like this. So 4-4 four four is our average. See how I did that? I got quiet for a few seconds. 90,000 ratings. <gasps> We're at 4-6. Four 4.22. Four is that all? It must... That that highest score must be on like Beer Advocate or something. All right, four two two, and we're a four six. Yes. Yeah, I'm good with the four six. Yeah. Because this this is outstanding, and you can find it. Yes. It's in the stores, not it's in the stores. distributed anymore. Over here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And not only is this awesome, Pompeii by them is. is you great. like Pompeii a lot. Yeah. It's a great. $13 a four-pack. Uh, I'm assuming this is the same price for Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Man, I'm going to buy this now, too. I'm going to buy both of them. Right Especially now? when I work overtime. Right now? Yeah. Not right now. I got a, a lot of beer. I know. I know. I saw that. A lot of beer in the fridge. A lot of beer in, in, in our review fridge. is full again. Oh, hopefully we were down to like four beers, and then boom. All came back in, yeah. It, it came back in. If you like this sweatshirt, check us out. You on know where you can find it? Redbubble.com. Yeah, it's uh, Redbubble.com/slash/people/slash/FrenchHaws. Something. It's in the description. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the link. Though. But usually, maybe you should put it up here. Uh, now you have to. I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> no, uh, really, really, yeah, yeah. It's, it's hard to do that. All right, we'll erase that. But um. Check it out. A lot of times there's 20% off sales or, or 20, 25, 25. Yeah. We put those out on our social media things when the sales are. They're usually 24 hour sales. Sometimes they extend them. But mm-hmm. uh, not a bad deal. The shirts are good quality. Uh, t shirts are nice. And um, get some. Get some. Post, post your pictures. Go to our Facebook. Yeah, yeah, Facebook, French Rose Beer Reviews, and uh, post pictures of you with your shirts on. We'd love to see yeah, that. Yeah, definitely. Um, they do they have leggings? Oh, yeah. Yeah, leggings. We French haven't Rose. sold any yet. None yet? I don't know why. They're amazing. It's, I mean, who wants to be the... you got to be the first one to check out these leggings. I might get them. Yeah. Yeah. God, don't. <laughs> Everything is listed down below where you can find us. If you like what we're doing here... We do this every two days we put out a new beer review. So yep. subscribe. It's very easy. You just at the bottom we have our little a little water thing with um it's a hop symbol. Click on that, subscribe, hit the notifications bell. You're done. You'll know when we're on live, when we're when we're putting a new review out. That's all we ask. It's simple. New lips. I spilled. New lips. Yes. That's all we got on this one. That's it. This is a great beer. Uh, what do we get it as? Four six. Huh? What was our score? Four six. Yeah. Right. right. I was a four two. Yeah, and I was high. We were four four. Yes. Four four. Four six for me. Four two for you. Four four average, which was above average. The untapped average. Yes. But this was a high ranker, I think, on Beer Advocate. Which we kind of did the poo poo beer ad. Yeah, everything's a high. High mark. Yeah. Like rape beer, everything's 100. Right. But anyhow, yeah, we're not here to knock people. No, but we did. You did. <laughs> See you Thank next you time. for watching. <laughs> hundreds of bottles of beer on the wall, hundreds of bottles of beer. Which one's the right one for me? Sometimes the answer's not that clear. My best bet's to begin by turning on into French Hall.